Hey heroes, hope you're all having an amazing day. I'm Roy Kayin, thank you so much as always for taking the time to check out my channel and check out this brand new video. And guys, welcome to Christmas Countdown, day 18. Alrighty guys, as you can see on screen, we have a, a mystery Pokemon present. Now, for those of you that don't know, we are currently doing a Christmas countdown. So my girlfriend Kaylee very kindly organized a advent calendar Pokemon edition. Uh, so I've been opening up a mystery Pokemon present every single day in December and we will be doing so up until Christmas. And guys, we are currently on day 18. It is a big present opening. We have a, a big mystery Pokemon present in front of us. I am so so excited so guys if you are as excited as i am to find out exactly what is inside the mystery present smash that like button subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and leave a comment down below letting me know what you think it is but guys you don't have to wait too long to find out because we're about to open it up a few moments later and guys our christmas countdown day 18 pokemon present is a pokemon celebrations tin amazing all right guys for those of you that don't know there is a special pokemon celebrations tin it wasn't very well advertised it was the single celebrations product that i didn't manage to get my hands on until now um, aside from the premium collection box so i believe i've opened up every other celebrations product uh, but guys we have the dark sylveon tin in front of us it looks absolutely amazing so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna open up and we are going to see if we can pull a Charizard, maybe a shiny Mew. So let's get into it. Alrighty, guys, I'm going to open up the celebrations tin very carefully. Alrighty, guys, as you can see on camera, the celebrations tin comes with the incredible looking Dark Sylveon V card. Now, for those of you that missed it, I have already opened up the celebrations Dark Sylveon box, so we already have one of these, but it is one of the best looking celebrations cards out there, and it looks absolutely phenomenal. So, we now have two of those. We also have a co card on screen for you there. As I do in all my videos, I give those out. We have actually quite a lot of celebrations packs we have a one two three four five six celebrations pokemon packs and we also have a boost pack of chilling rain and darkness ablaze Alrighty guys, before we go ahead and open up the Pokemon cards for the day, you already know what time it is. It is of course time for... Lucky's Last Pack Magic. As you can see, our cat Lucky is ready for his section of the video. He is waiting very patiently for his cat treat. So what I'm going to do, bud, is I am going to throw the cat treat towards the cards. And whichever pack you come to first will have our last pack magic for the day. So you ready? On three one easy two three there we go there we go i threw the cat treat way too far and now he has absolutely no interest in the cards which one is it gonna be bud you gonna be oh and i think i think yes we definitely have a winner with this celebrations pack over here as always a thank you for your help buddy and enjoy your cat treats Alrighty guys, as you can see, we are back in the recording studio, aka the games room, and Lucky has very helpfully picked the celebrations pack, which should hopefully have some last pack magic in there for us. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep that to the side for the time being. And as you can hear, he is very eager to be a part of the video again. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up the door for Lucky. And as you can see, Lucky has decided to join us for our card opening today, wishing us even more good luck. Thank you, bud. All right, guys, here we go with our very first celebrations pack of the day. Absolutely my favorite Pokemon set from this year, obviously celebrating the 25th anniversary of Pokemon. So I'm going to go ahead. We're going to open this up. And as I do in all of my videos, I give out the code cards. So there we go. And there's not really a card trick for celebration. So we're just going to flip it on over and see what we get. Here we go. All right, we are starting with a, a Dialga, going into a, a Zekrom. Our third card is 
a Team Magma's Groudon. Now, I believe we have already pulled this card. Uh, we have pulled a lot of the Celebrations cards because we have done a lot of openings, but I know that is definitely a, one of the a rarer cards in the set, which is absolutely a fire. And guys, our final card for the first pack is a Zamazenta V. So guys, that is a pretty awesome start to our opening right there. Alrighty guys, moving on to the second pack of the day. I'll get your co-card for you right there. And we are going to flip this over. So here we go. We have a Cosmo M. We have a Dialga. Going into a Kyogre. And our final card is a Lunala. That's okay guys, only the second pack. We've still got a few more to go, so let's go. All right, guys, moving on to our third celebrations pack of the day with your co-card feed there. And we are going to flip this over. I'm going to guess we start with a Zekrom. I don't know why, random guess, but here we go. I was completely wrong. <laughs> there we go. We are starting with a Ho-Oh. Going into a Xerneas, one of the very nice looking cards in the set. Going into a Yveltal. Our final card is a Lunala. Okay, I'm getting a little bit worried, but we've still got a few more packs to open, so don't worry, guys. Alrighty, guys, moving on to the fourth celebrations pack of the day. And I hope you guys are having an amazing start to Christmas. Uh, there is your next co-pod for you there. Um, Christmas is obviously coming up very soon and I've been absolutely loving the fact that I get to open a mystery Pokemon present every single day. So again, just a big, big shout out and thank you to my girlfriend Kaylee for organizing all of this. Um, yeah, it's been a lot of Christmas fun. So here we go with the full pack. We have a Cosmog. We've got a Yveltal. I'm getting a little bit worried now, but hopefully we can get a good pull with a Dawn fan. And guys, I think that is the first time we have pulled the Celebrations Dawn fan. So there we go, a brand new addition to our set right there. And going into a Solgardio. Alrighty guys, moving on to the second last pack of the day. I'm really hoping we can get a big pull in this one. So there is your co-card. All right, here we go, here we go. Starting with a Cosmo. Mm, okay, okay, we got this, guys. We've got this. Going into a Xerneas. Going into a Reshiram. And our final card is... Ooh, okay. It's, it's been a tough opening, I won't lie. It's, it's uh, hasn't been too great, but we've got one pack left. So let's hope. Alrighty guys, here we go with the final celebrations pack of the day. As you can see on camera, I will probably have some extremely overdramatic effects, uh, some overdramatic music. I, I am very excited. Lucky has hopefully blessed us with some last pack magic. So let's find out if he has. Alrighty guys, your final code card on screen for you there. And we are starting with a Kyogre, that is a good start to our final pack. Going into a Dialga. Our third card is a Cosmog. And our final Celebrations card of the day is a Hollow Mew. Okay, at least it was a Hollow Pool. That's not too bad. Alrighty guys. That wasn't the best celebrations opening we've had on the channel. It was uh, it was actually very difficult to get good pulls uh, from the tin. So what I'm gonna do, I don't usually do this, but we are going to open some bonus Pokemon packs right here, starting with Chilling Rain because I, I just can't let it end like this. I really can't. So we're gonna go ahead, open this up, and we are going to hope that we have some last pack magic saved for one of these two packs. Here we go. Alrighty guys, a surprise additional uh, co-card for you right there on screen. And guys, as I mentioned, I can't let it end like this. So we are opening the Chilling Rain pack right now. We are starting with a fire energy. That could be a very good sign. And here we go. We got a Dynatree Hill. Justify Gloves. Again, I don't know why there are so many gloves in some of these sets, but there we go. Uh, we've got a Porygon 2. The, uh, the the saddest looking Galarian Farfetch'd I think I've ever seen. Uh, we've got a Furfrow. We have a, a Venipede. Going into the happiest looking feel. 
Going to a Crab Ruler. Is this a reverse? It is, and it is. And a Bomber Snow, very fitting. And guys, our final card for the Chilling Rain Pack is a Hollow Beedrill. Our luck is just not picking up today, guys. All right, guys, one more bonus Pokemon Pack left to open. So let's hope we get some sort of last pack magic here. Here we go. Alrighty guys, your actual final code card is on screen for you there. And we are going with one more pack. We are going to hope we get some good pulls today. It's been, oh man, it's been rough today. But here we go guys, here we go. Starting with an unlisted leaf energy. Going into a Vanillish. Uh, we've got a Piers trainer card. We have a big parasol because, you know, the weather hasn't been great recently. Uh, we've got a Dino. Going into an Electroik. Going into a Galarian Mr. Mime. We have a Rickety Dickety Doo. We've got a Tauros. Our Reverse Hollow is a Reverse Golet. Very nice. Guys, can we get any sort of pack magic today? Here we go. Our last card is a Center Scorch a V. There we go, guys. At least it wasn't too bad of an ending right there. Alrighty guys, it is time for Ryan's recap of the day, starting with the Hollow Mew we pulled in the Celebration set. Now, for those of you that haven't seen any of my other Celebrations opening, I believe this is like the, the 15th Mew we have pulled, uh, but again, I can't complain because Mew is one of my favourite legendary Pokemon, and it is a Hollow at least, so there we go. We also managed to pull the Center Scorch V card for some last pack magic right there, which was a... Uh, quite desperately needed let's be honest uh we also pulled the zamazenta v uh always always a great v card to pull we managed to pull dawn fan for the very first time from the celebration set so i am more than happy with that and guys our biggest pull from the day was probably team magmas a groudon again i think i've doubled up on this now but that is a great card to uh to have a duplicate of Alrighty guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video there. Apologies, I didn't get as many great pulls as I was hoping to from the Celebration set. Uh, but it was really cool to open up one of these Celebrations tins because I had been looking for them everywhere. Uh, I kind of, I think I saw it at Tesco's months ago. Um, and by the time I came back there, it sold out. And I, I thought I was going crazy because I genuinely couldn't find it anywhere online. And I just didn't think it existed. But finally managed to get my hands on it. Uh, uh, so yeah, again, a, a big thank you to my girlfriend Kaylee for organising the Pokemon Advent Calendar I'm doing at the moment. Um, I'm having so much fun doing these uh, Christmas themed videos. And guys, uh, it's coming up to Christmas soon, so I hope you're all having an amazing holiday. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you again in the next Pokemon card opening.